Hi guys, this is Craig from EasySetPoolCare.com and today I'm going to go through what you need to buy for your Intech EasySet Pool in 2021. Now if you remember last year, everything got sold out really quick. Everybody stocked up and they, they, they bought everything, so everything went quickly. So let's get right into it. The first thing, if you need a new pool... If you don't have one, you need to buy an Intech Easy Set pool. Now, the price on these have gone up over the last couple of years. Obviously, it was because of supply and demand. There just wasn't as many around. And they stayed up in price, not quite as much as they were. But um, as demand goes up and supplies down, you're going to have to, you're going to spend even more. So if you need one, you should go and grab one right now. I have the links below in the description, so you can just click on that, and it'll take you right to these pages so you can buy them. But um, what I have is an 18 by 48 inch. Um, it's 18 foot, and it's a it's not huge, and it's not small either, but um, it's the biggest one that they offer in the Easy Set line. Um, and honestly, once you like follow my videos and you see how easy it is, it's definitely worth it like i had my last one for seven years before i replaced just the liner and it takes you like you know once i figured it out it took me like an hour to set up an hour to tear down in store it, it's just it's really easy but in tech they do a horrible job at showing you how to <laughs> how to do all that stuff but anyway first thing is if you don't have the pool obviously you should grab the pool and if you can afford it this pump has gone up in price as well, and um, I'll tell you, it's one of the best investments you can make with your pool. For some reason, Intec gives you an inferior pool uh, pump that just doesn't work as well as it should. The bigger the pump, usually the better, because what this is doing is this is sucking the water out of your pool, along with the dirt going through your filter, cleaning the water, and then putting it back into your pool. So this is one of the major keys for keeping your pool clean. So if you can afford it, I would definitely upgrade your pump. And one thing with the pump, you're going to have to understand which uh, filters to get with that. We'll, we'll get to that in a minute. But if you can afford it, I would upgrade your pump. Next thing is the chlorine tablets. Like these are one of the major keys for keeping your pool clean. Um, this is one of the things I discovered and I, I was just amazed how easy it can be if you have the right things for your pool. Um, one of the things with these is that they the, the packaging has changed. It's pretty much the same thing. I used to get a three in one and now I get these, which is a four in one and they work just as well, probably even better. I just didn't, you know, I, did, I didn't notice what the extra one was, but um, the four in one part. But anyway, um, these sell out really quickly. So if you, I would go and get as much of this as possible because you're going to need these. These are the, one of the major keys to keeping your pool clean. And the way I usually do it, I'm going to go to the next slide, is the floater. You need a floater. Like, I'll usually put anywhere from one to three of these in each, in the floater, and just let it in the pool at all times. <laughs> and, and I'll leave it in the pool at all times. There's Amazon sending me stuff. Anyway, um, there's another video for that you can check out. With the floater, you're going to need a floater. You can get it at Walmart. You can get it anywhere you want. Right here, there's a link down there. You can get it straight from, you can just add it to your cart and Amazon as well. Um, now, this is important. Make sure you get the right type of filters for, I mean, yeah, the filters for your um, actual pump. And it'll tell you on the pump which ones to get. Like for my pump, it's a type B. And I tell you what, it was really hard to find these last year. And so if you if you don't have any of these or you need these, you should grab these right away. Now, one thing with me is that I don't like to use a new filter every week. I mean, it's easy to do that. Just take the filter out, put a new one in and go. But I like to clean it out and use it for at least two or three weeks. And it's fine. It really is. If my water starts getting a little dirty, then I'll be like, all right, let's just replace the filter. But... Most of the time, I will just take the take the filter out, and there's a video for this, 
and I'll just hose it down and clean all the dirt out of it. And uh, I mean, I'll take my time, probably take me like 10 minutes or something and, and reuse it. And you can definitely do that. Now, I just bought this kit and these kits are, I mean, they're not perfect, but you need something to clean your pool. And these right here help get a lot of like bugs. If any bugs get on top of your pool, you can just skim them out. So now one of the things I don't use, I don't use one of those things that hangs on the top of the pool and runs all the time with your pump to like a skimmer, like in a regular in-ground pool. I don't, I didn't. I tried that before and it just didn't work. I keep it simple. My pool stays clean and, and all that. So anyway, with these, you'd hook your hose up to these and it would suck up some of the water. This one I bought, but it's not my favorite. I actually use this one. Um, and there's links for both of these down there. I have both of them, so I'll switch back and forth. One thing about this one to note is that it doesn't come with the pole. You're going to have to buy your own pole. Now, if you can see my mouse move, over here is where you would put your hose into this, and then you put your pole here. And what happens is the water goes down and it creates a suction so that it, it as you go along it, along the bottom of your pole, very slowly, I usually pull backwards and forward just a little bit, it'll suck the dirt up into to the bag. And um, it actually surprisingly works pretty well it's not perfect but um it works pretty well um so that's what i'll use now i wanted to, to let's just let you know that a lot of times like they will show you down here in amazon that all the things you can buy together one of the things is the kit i just showed you the other one is the pole that goes with this and then also those chlorine tablets um just make sure like sometimes they'll pair stuff together and they don't they're not exactly they're not the, what I recommend. So make sure that it, it fits that list because that's what's going to make your pool clean and keep it clean all summer and give you the least amount of work. So anyway, I'm Craig from EasySetPoolCare.com and be sure to subscribe down below and check the links for all these things. And don't wait because if it's anything like last year, and I honestly believe that things are going to sell out, um, you're, you're going you're gonna to be without some of the key components you need to keep your pool clean and enjoyable for the rest of the summer. And make it a great day. I'll catch you later.